there's nothing like a homemade cake. <clears throat> and that's nothing like a homemade cake. Don't worry. Jackie will love it anyway. Why isn't she here? It's almost lunchtime. Crash, she's not going to be rushing anywhere. She's injured, remember? <sighs> we should have got her present to cheer her up. Flying! Freddie Mercer's here. That's as good as a coming home present. Oh, nonsense. I'm just an old has-been. Uh, an old has-been with an Olympic medal. Freddie used to run with Jackie's grandpa in the olden days. Oh, right. Can't wait the three of us back together again. One for all and all for one. The Three Musketeers. Marco lost his powers. Which superhero is he exactly? Recycle Man. You're not funny. Well, you've been waiting for days. It's beginning to take on powers of its own. What's the matter, Marco? We're out of costume ideas. Oh, it's none of your business. They're right. I've completely run out of ideas. I can't go to Jackie's party without a new costume. No, I can't go as just Marco. Marco dresses up. I am what I wear. Jackie, back! Go without me. I'm a nobody. I'm the boringest boy in the world. Jackie, you've been missed you so much. Jackie. Oh, wait, here we've got a special surprise for you. Hi, Jackie. Welcome home. We're having a party for you. So, you're the famous Jackie. Hi, I'm Mike. Hi. How's your leg? Let me have a look. Is it broken? It would be in a cast if it was broken, wouldn't it? Leave me alone. I don't want to talk about it. Surprise! What's he doing here? Jackie? i help you unpack. What part of Leave Me Alone don't you understand? All that work? For nothing? She obviously doesn't want to be here. She's probably just tired after her journey. Her leg was hurting her. Yeah. Let's go and see how she's doing. Uh, Crash, could you pop in my office, please? I need to have a chat with you. Well, that went down like a lead balloon. I'm sure she didn't mean it. Once she's unpacked and settled in, she's bound to want to see you. I hope you're right. Need a hand with that? No, thanks. Actually, Freddie, would you mind um, having a look at Duke's beans? <laughs> I think I'm killing him. Consider it done. I'm a boy. I can't dress up as a girl. No offence. Girls are great. I just wouldn't want to be one. Oh, what am I going to do? Oh, about time. What a lame one. None of your business. Oh. <laughs> Musketeers. No. Hello. We haven't met, have we? What's your name? Cat got your tongue, cat got your tongue. <laughs> when I was dressed as a tramp. <sighs> hey, what's up, kiddo? Everyone's mad at me. Either that or I've got the world's worst B.O. Oh. <laughs> Very funny. Nobody's mad at you. Well, they're doing a pretty good job of pretending. Go away, Tracy. Leave me alone, Tracy. But, uh, Jackie's bound to be a bit upset having to come back and live here. Yeah. 
probably heard about your cooking. <laughs> Touche. So what's Crash's excuse? Um, look. I'm telling you this because right now he needs a friend more than he needs a care worker or a social worker. He's upset because his dad's been in touch. He wants to come see him. says he's having anger management classes. Well, that's a good thing, isn't it? Too little, too late. He might just want to say he's sorry. <sighs> People like him always say they're sorry. They just never mean it. He might have changed. Oh, what do you know about it? You don't know him. You don't even know your own dad. <sighs> nice one, Crash. Exactly, a stress fracture, torn ligament. It's sort of a soft tissue injury. Sounds really bad. Don't you believe me or something? We're not sure to have a garden. What were you thinking of? Look, he was only having a look at Duke's beans. And what if he hurts himself? Oh, yeah, I forgot about the attack of the killer beans. You can't be too careful. This is a care home, not an old folks' recreation centre. Oh. There must be something I haven't worn yet. Worn that. Worn that. Worn that. I've got nothing new. It's all old, old, old. Millie? <sighs> See? Even Millie thinks I'm boring. I've been looking for you. How are you going? Best get out of your way. You said you're in the way. Young Elaine reminded me that I'm an old man, not much use to anyone. Please don't leave. Jackie needs you. There's something really wrong, Freddy. It's not just their leg. What? What's wrong? I don't know. I was hoping you'd help me find out. Sometime before we get older, be nice. Hmm. Do you think you can get her to the garden? I'll see what I can do. You look like you've lost a pound and found a sixpence. You feel like telling someone who will probably forget it all by tea time? You wanted. Go away. Yeah, yeah, you want to be left alone. Well, you can't. Freddy's waiting in the garden for you. Well, I didn't ask him to come, did I? At least you could do is say hello. What would your grandpa think if he knew you were letting down one of his best friends? You don't have to see him if you don't want to. You're in charge. Look, this controls these, and they won't do anything you don't tell them to. Thanks, Freddy. What? In the hoop. In one. Okay. 
You're on. enough for me. <laughs> you know, Jackie, when your grandpa and I were young athletes together, we learned a lot about sports injuries. Oh, no. Want to take a look at that leg? No. no. Why not? There's nothing wrong with my leg. Oh? I faked it so I could come home. Oh, homesick, eh? I was desperate. I missed everyone. Even Elaine the pain? Yep, that is desperate. It was just training all the time. I want to be a runner, like Grandpa. But it's too hard. And now I'm glad he's not here to see what a big fat failure I am. You're not a failure. You just weren't ready. But it was my one chance and I've thrown it away. Don't you worry. Just leave it with me. Thank you. Freddy, drink. I've just spoken to the academy. I'm to supervise some light training for Jackie until she's ready to go back. Good. So, uh, what do you think about that, Elaine? Oh, um, I'm very impressed, Freddy. I'm sure she'll flourish under your supervision. Thank you. Here comes trouble. I bet you can't guess what I am. I'm old and it's new. It's like looking in a mirror. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers! <laughs> I'm sorry I was so mean to you, Tracy. So sorry. Me too. I'm really sorry. Oh, give me a break. This is more sickening than Mike's food. Which reminds me... We've got a party to go to. I could at least limp a bit and make it look more convincing. Oh, 